in case you hadn't noticed, it has somehow become uncool to sound like you know what you're talking about <laughs> or believe strongly in what you're saying. <laughs> Invisible question marks and parenthetical you knows and you know what I'm sayings have been attaching themselves to the ends of our sentences, even when those sentences aren't questions. Declarative sentences, so-called because they used to like declare things to be true, you know, as opposed to other things that are like, not. <laughs> They've been infected by a tragically cool and totally hip interrogative tone. As if I'm saying, don't think I'm a nerd just because I've like noticed this. I don't have anything personally invested in my own opinions, okay? This is just like what I've heard, you know? This is just like word on the street. And I'm just like inviting you to join me on the bandwagon of my own uncertainty. <laughs> to our conviction. Where are the limbs out on which we once walked? Have they been like chopped down with the rest of the rainforest? You know? Or has society just become so filled with these conflicting feelings of duh that now we're just the most aggressively inarticulate generation to come along since a long time ago? <laughs> So we've just gotten to the point where we're just like, you know, whatever. <laughs> and actually, our unarticulation-ness is just a clever, you know, um, you know, uh, thing <laughs> to disguise the fact that we, on the inside, are just like totally you know? <laughs> totally! That's exactly what I'm talking about. I implore you. I entreat you. And I challenge you to speak with conviction. To say what you believe in a manner that bespeaks the determination with which you believe it. Because contrary to the wisdom of the bumper sticker, it is not enough these days to simply question authority. You gotta speak with it too. <laughs>